So my car's coolant system broke again today and it's gonna cost like $800 to fix again. No amount of finger guns can fix that. So what we're gonna do is find the strangest news headlines from around the world and hopefully have a chuckle at them. Cause laughter fixes everything except for my car. Woman in sumo wrestler's suit assaulted her ex-girlfriend in gay pub after she waved at a man dressed as a Snickers bar. So there's a lot to unpack here. First of all, what? Second of all, was this like a Halloween party? Because not only do we have a woman in a sumo wrestler suit, but we've also got a man dressed as a Snickers bar. Depending on where this pub is, I'm not sure that that's a common occurrence. But weirder things have happened, who am I to judge? <laughs> Don't know what that laugh was. However, one armed man applauds. <laughs> one armed man applauds the kindness of strangers. Now that is cold. I'm gonna save that though. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. <gasps> what the fuck? Bugs flying around with wings are flying bugs. This is the quality content I signed up for. Whatever this person paid for their degree, it was worth every cent. Statistics show that teen pregnancy dro drops off significantly after age 25. I would fucking hope so. I see that we're using the term teen quite loosely here. Homicide victims rarely talk to police. So who's gonna tell them? Waterford boy ate, saved sister's life, and then in the quotes underneath it, it says, I wouldn't do it again. She's been a pain this week. Poor. Oh, that's not gonna go down well at the dinner table, is it? Jets Patriots jump head goes, <laughs> multiple times at uni, I had been writing assignments and they saved the file, like fuck this shit or something. And I have on numerous occasions nearly handed that file in. God, that could be a whole nother video, honestly. What is going on here? Best man left bleeding after being hit in the head by a flying dildo. And wait, <laughs> and wait until you hear where it came from do tell and of course it's from the northern territory because because obviously this happened in the northern territory <laughs> safety meeting ends in accident that is my kind of safety meeting but this one from the daily mercury that says i was bashed with a dildo again with the dildos why i was bashed with a dildo by a man in leather mask dot 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 and he killed my dog <laughs> side note he killed my dog also luxury apartments now for lease really great ad to accompany that kind of a headline man accused of killing lawyer receives a new attorney that is a fucking power move. I literally need a second to process that. I don't understand. <laughs> Man gets shock of his life when he buys two toy poodles for $150. First of all, bargain. Only to be told by a vet that they're actually giant rodents pumped up with steroids to look like dogs. This is arguably more stressful than my car. But... First of all, <laughs> you don't get two toy poodles for $150. Second of all, this guy needed to be told by a vet <laughs> that he bought two rats for $150. What steroids could you give a rat to make it look like a dog? Mm. Oh God, how do you even ask Google this? Can you give rats steroids? Really upset that this is now in my Google history. Brazilian rats on steroids are the hot new puppy. So this is a thing. So it's not rats, it's ferrets. You give ferrets steroids and they look barely like a dog. It just looks like a ferret with a lot of hair. <laughs> Donkey bomb kills eight in Tira market. Donkey bomb? Is this a particular type of bomb called a donkey bomb or a bomb made out of donkeys? It's my first question. Could Google it, but I like the mystery. Drunken student is locked up and fined for calling a police horse gay. If only actual gay people were afforded that kind of respect. I do love the structure of this photo. It's clearly just a ripped newspaper taken on a dirty laptop. Mm. The North Devon Journal says, drunk torch peanut bag and made love to ambulance. That is not nice to read. What is that? Drunk torched peanut bag and made love to ambulance. A drunk torched a peanut bag and made love to an ambulance would make more sense. Is that what's happened, North Devon Journal? <laughs> I have a lot more questions than I have answers currently. I was paralyzed by a pork chop. <sighs> the dream. Pastor Kiwe we see in bum sex scandal. Okay. Oh my God, no, it doesn't stop there. Boy drags flashy man of God to police for terrorizing his buttocks with monster whopper. <coughs> what the fuck? Mm, that is a lot to take in. Deer with rabies kicks LaVail woman in the face. It's pretty standard. Really tells you what state the world's in when that's not surprising. Oregon man changes name to Captain Awesome. 
wish he didn't. I really don't like secondhand embarrassment. Psychics predict the world didn't end yesterday. Fucking same. Man ate stolen ice cream sandwich he kept in his pants. Hardly seems newsworthy. I do that most days of the week. Army vehicle disappears. <laughs> Oh, this is the kind of comedy I really was looking for. Mayor Paris to homeless, go home. And he's the mayor? Utah Poison Control Center reminds everyone not to take poison. God, here I was, poisoned at the ready. Can the Department of Transport remind me not to get hit by a car, please? Study shows frequent sex enhances pregnancy chances. Some really good work you guys are doing over there. Keep it up. Condom truck tips, spills. For fuck's sake, honestly. City unsure why sewer smells. Look, I'm no expert, but here's my two cents. It could be from all the shit. 17 remain dead in morgue shooting spree. Oh fuck. That is fucking bleak. That's also a really responsible shooting. Like that's, if you're gonna have a shooting, that's probably the best place for it. Local child wins gun from fundraiser. If that isn't America in a nutshell. Puerto Rican teen named Mistress of the Universe. She is gonna be busy. Tiger Woods plays with own balls, Nike says. Mm, really could have worded that one a little bit better. No, they actually couldn't have, that's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Forecasters call for weather on Monday. The rest of the week though, literally zero atmosphere. We're probably all gonna die. Cows lose their jobs as milk prices drop. <laughs> Can just imagine a cow holding its little briefcase trying to keep a steady income. Miracle Cure kills fifth patient. That's what I look for in my cures. Death. <laughs> Is Miracle Cure the name of a serial killer? Because that would make a lot more sense. State population to double by 2040. Babies to blame. There's fucking babies. Procreating all over the place with no regard for anyone else. In the outdoors section, we've got breathing oxygen linked to staying alive. Amazing. Cannot wait to see what breakthroughs the outdoors section brings us next. Police arrest everyone on February 22nd. <laughs> Shit. I guess it really do be like that though. <laughs> Straight up, Thursday is cancelled, sorry. Bridge closure date, Thursday or October. <laughs> what the fuck? State's detour plans draw criticism. I cannot understand why. <laughs> Beautiful, mate. Most earthquake damage is caused by shaking. Honestly, so glad I know that now. I had previously assumed it was caused by nasty words. Federal agents raid gun shop, find weapons. Really, we would hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Why does this read like a Tumblr post? Muddy Creek problem. It's too muddy. Snaps for that headline. Thank you so much, Jim Buis, for writing that beautiful headline for us. Murderer says detective has ruined his reputation. So he murdered someone. Big deal. People do it all the time. Oh, it gets better. A convicted murderer has sued the detective who arrested him. You can do that apparently. This is news to me. Can you sue a detective for defamation because you murdered someone? You know what always fucks me up is I have no idea how many murderers are watching my videos. Sometimes I think about it and I just have to take a nap. Alton attorney accidentally sues himself. Now he's either really good at his job or really bad at his job, but either way the legal system is broken. Hospitals resort to hiring doctors. <sighs> Damn, because when I go to a hospital I really just want people that they've found at a bus stop. <laughs> Farmer using cannon to protect watermelons. Don't blame him, they're gorgeous. But the question is, is he loading the cannon with watermelons? Because that would kind of defeat the purpose. Voters to vote on whether or not to vote. This is Pauline Hansen's it's okay to be white motion in a nutshell. It's the most redundant waste of everybody's time. Museums full of history. Yes, and the post office is full of mail. Goat accused of robbery. I'm really gonna need some context here. Police in Nigeria are holding a goat on suspicion of attempted armed robbery. <laughs> the goat is in our custody. Vigilantes saw some hoodlums attempting to rob a car. One escaped while the other turned into a goat. So the context didn't help. Okay, so that was kind of weird. If you're new here, you should subscribe. <laughs> if you're new here, you should subscribe because I don't know why. If you're new here, you should subscribe because honestly, it's taking so much mental energy for me to even talk right now. Right now, right at this second, you fly over our house. They're probably doing something important, but I'm filming a YouTube video, so who's really contributing to society? Anyway, you should subscribe because I give shout outs every week to people who subscribe. Put the notification bell on, let me know, get a shout out, that's how it works. If you like free shit and you weren't already aware, my clothing line is having a giveaway. You can win this vinyl um, flag and two cool t-shirts. By the way, I have a clothing line. We've got some really cool shit up at the moment. You should definitely go check that out if you want to. I also give shout outs to people who like comment on my shit all the time on Instagram and like my photos and all that kind of stuff to say thank you. Shout outs are coming from this photo and they 
go to Jeff the Pineapple Unicorn. <laughs> Great username, by the way. Pippi Drop and Charlotte Coombs. Thank you guys for commenting on my photos. Shoutouts from YouTube go to K-San. Great song. Someone that just named Holly. Mia Luxton. And Genevieve. Thank you guys so much for subscribing and putting your notification bell on. It's actually so fucking difficult. Notification is a long word. Also, it turns out a lot of you liked watching me fall over in the last video, which was this bit. <laughs> So first of all, you're welcome because I have this gnarly bruise. See, this is why you have ripped jeans so you can show people your bruises. I don't know if you can see that. It's very purple. It was pretty much black the other day. So yeah, don't make box towers in your room and then jump on them because literally what else is going to happen? Mm -hmm.